<laughs> hey Gemini, what's going on? This is Solo69 and welcome to my channel. I am here for a quick message from the universe for Gemini Sun, Moon, Rising, or wherever it falls into your chart. Um, I won't be doing the general readings this month. I am too busy, so I'm throwing in these quick ones along with any other random ones to make sure that I try to keep y'all satisfied and all of that good stuff, you know? So, the reading may not resonate for all of your Gemini, sun, moon, rising, or wherever, you know, um, it, it's like this sometimes. So, if it doesn't, go ahead and check with your other placements and see what's popping off with those, or you can check back later on within the month and see if it makes sense. Or just simply enjoy the entertainment of it all. Other than that, please like, subscribe, 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 <laughs> and share if you care. Leave a comment. That's cool. Whatever you like. You can have whatever you like. T.I. <laughs> oh, it's in my head. I don't know the song, but I'm just going to rock with it. The phone on ice. <laughs> you can have whatever you like. Okay. Gemini, what's popping? Okay. That you have options. is meaningful. You need to know that you have options is meaningful, Gemini. Be true to yourself is here. You know, that, that you have options is meaningful. See? So, keep that in mind. You got options. You can have whatever you like. <laughs> I just said that shit. Time to make a demonstration of those options, you know? You can have whatever you like. <laughs> it's just gonna keep on fucking with me. <laughs> <sighs> it's not always about being right. It's not only about being right either. You know, the, when it comes down to these options. It's about what you like. <laughs> you can have whatever now nah, that should have get you in jail <laughs> karma <laughs> be careful you still be careful about what you wish for you know what i'm saying because you just might get it at the same time and when you get certain things that you wish for you make sure you know that you understand that that's a blessing and so don't treat it bad you know sometimes we get we, we pray for things and ask for things and when it comes to us it's not in a way that we look for it to come so you know that's where the shit gets hard and it hits the fan and that that's some that's some hurting type shit if it get hard and then it hit the fan <laughs> it stink it hurt <laughs> And it's messy. Thank you for your wisdom, guidance, and understanding. For Gemini, Sun, Moon, and Rising. Let's see what divine message from the universe that's quick, that's popping off and coming in for you, Gemini. Uh, what message do you have for Gemini for October 2021? I will not be, um, I will be pulling the tarot, but I will not be, um, Clarified anything. Just we'll see. Anyway, let's keep going. Okay. You needn't worry. Shot off the table, so you might need to worry. <laughs> Just saying, this for somebody. Somebody might, um, <laughs> they might not be thinking like they need to worry about something, but you know, wrong. Anyway, it's not only about being right once again. Mm, that shadow is real, ain't it? So, oh, we, oh, we, in all tests of character, when two viewpoints are put together, are put against each other in the final analyst the things that will strike you is the most will strike you the most is not what was wrong all right strong or weak wise or foolish but who went to the greater length in considering the other's perspective don't you agree the universe 
So sometimes it's not about who, you know, sometimes it's just trying to see who, who are you going to try to understand where this person is coming from? You know, sometimes, you know, that, that distorts the whole lack of communication, the whole, you know, perseverance of it all in the first place. Because if you're not trying to understand it, why are you even trying to hear it? You know, if you don't understand it, you know, ask. You know, that's why questions are here. That's why question marks exist. Um, but it's not about arguing about it or against it or against each other. And if you just don't agree, you just don't agree. But still, even if you don't agree, at least you can say that you understand from that person's viewpoint and their perspective of a situation here. So being able to take out the time to listen to someone and hear what they break down and say to you instead of already having your mind made up that this person is wrong or whatever. You know, you could be dealing with this. Somebody could be like this with you, you know, definitely. So it's about... It's about making sure that you really, really look at it from the other person's viewpoint. Or somebody may need to look at it from your viewpoint. But you have to be able to show it. Love doesn't have to mean near. Love doesn't have to mean near. Some are better. Love at, loved at a distance. For a while anyway. And that's okay. Besides, love doesn't really know the difference. And how can it tell? It's, you know, you, you gotta, you, somebody gotta be right up under you to love them, to know that, that they, you know, to, to, for you to know that you really love them. No, they don't. You don't gotta be close to them at all if you know that your love is really content. But some people need to hold that undenying love next to them, right there with them. And, you know. You got to understand that if it's real, it can stretch from seas to seas and shit like that, right? Supposedly. All right, so for one, this came out, which you do need to know and be aware of, and that's that you are adored. Now, this came out in limbo because I feel like you may be stuck in this energy trying to figure out if you are adored. But, you know, you, you could be growing into this energy of realizing that you actually are adored. You know, some genuine ass adorism. <laughs> don't be fooled by the players and don't be fooled by yourself. There is no one more lovable nor loved than you. And I know everyone precious. The universe so this message is to come in and let you know that like don't let nobody tear you down or make you feel like you're not adored because you are and you may need to realize that and this being in limbo i feel like you could be in this energy of trying to you know figure out if someone actually has a certain adorism about you or even if you may feel like this about somebody else but what we have here, this is a hidden attribute as far as I'm concerned for you, Gemini. And it's saying you have more options than you realize, which that came out. That that came out because you don't have to worry about some something that's making you feel less than, right? Okay, you have more options than you realize. Spoke this shit earlier. It says it sure is hard to get really angry at someone when you can think of it all, all the reasons you love them. Reasons, the reasons that we're here. Did I? Okay, I think it was this reading I just saw on this. Shit. <laughs> okay, I'm, okay. Anyway, so <laughs> I think it is. <laughs> if not, I'm having a real deja vu ass glitch. Okay, so somebody could be having glitches, deja vu moments. <laughs> deja vu moments stuff that's feeling unreal i do feel like some of you could be having moments to where you are having flashes with your past past life is probably coming in this is letting you know that um if, if it feels like that deja vu moment of a movie or time just went by something just happened and you don't understand it um 
that's because something something has triggered from your past life that is re recircling and recycling itself and in some cases that's not a good thing but in a lot of cases it can be a, a great thing it's uh, you know the, it lets you know that you're still on a certain path and it's replaying out but it's also certain times when you're dealing with glitches in situations like that as well to where when you are um in a position with how can i put it it's kind of a warning of of don't you know this needs something needs to change it does not need to be repeated the cycle so it's something about that that you should pay attention to here gemini or a cycle that that was repeated that could be harmful here be careful let's go ahead and um get <clears throat> let's go ahead and see what's going on with you when it comes down to these messages because Oh, hold on for one it says i already read it anyway well i'm being told to read it again so fuck it it says it sure is hard to really get angry at someone when you think of all the reasons you love them and you can the universe you can't think of all the reasons you really love somebody how can you get mad at this person for real but at the end of the day you also got to realize that you've got more options looking at something. It doesn't have to be options in people. It could be options in the way that you think about something, you know. Definitely when you're dealing with um, conflict, you know, and confusion. Or somebody not being 100% real about something. Because I do feel mask energy is here, Gemini. Yeah, but this is pertaining to love. Look, and if and somebody 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 wanting to give you a gift out of love. You are adored. Thank you for your wisdom, guidance, and understanding. Let's go ahead and see. When it comes to you have more options than you realize and you are adored in limbo, please show me for Gemini with this quick universal me oh, message oh yeah i forgot about this part that hit the floor sorry speaking about you need to not worry yeah you, it's something that you may need to put where a little a little nook if you buck under your truck you know what i'm saying because at the end of the day it's looking like it's something you may need to be a little concerned about it says there's no one in your life who hasn't always loved you but they're still just learning how to show it be big silly they you know they, they it, somebody may not just showing you they love you is off the table you know this is off the table even you know even if they do love you they're not gonna show it to you but i really feel like whoever this is they probably really didn't love you what to begin with that shit is off the table what's love got to do got to do with it okay ike okay tina because I'm catching the energy now of somebody just in it for the cause, in it to win. You know, this is not um, somebody doing something or having real emotions behind something. And, and, and right here, maybe somebody is just starting to get into that energy now. But it's like somebody had to realize that they are worth something else because somebody over here don't got no love. Here. Anyway, I'm finna eat. Okay. See what message come out. That keep in mind that that you need to worry is off the table. Somebody is worried maybe now because you know it's like they may not have had emotions or love to a situation, but now it's like they do. Ain't an earth here. Somebody's work. There's no one in your life who hasn't always loved you. They're just learning how to show it, right? Somebody was silly. Somebody pulled some silly shit. The Eight of Earth. Some, some, pertaining to music, maybe. Somebody has a guy that's helping them with music. I 
Why is your reading the longest? Anyway, messenger of earth is here. Somebody has a message to give so they could be moving towards, our, 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 you know, when, when it comes down to music and they're moving slow to give this message. So we got the star here, but we got the king of fire here in reverse. So that's what came out first is the king of fire. Okay, so it's looking like that somebody wasn't loyal to the star or loyal to an Aquarius. You may need to check into the Aquarius reading. It's looking like maybe a Taurus or an Aries. So right here, I'm getting, yeah, Taurus and Aries and Aquarian energy is here. But um, there's like some, somebody wasn't loyal to, to the star, to a situation here when it came down to even her work because the eight is here again, right here, one and seven. So, you know, somebody may have to pay for that. I don't know what the loyalty, what type of um, loyal situation here was going on, but somebody cheated the situation here. Um, somebody was flighty. This is a lies and shit, too. This is not a, a king to trust to me. Um, this is um, a sexual cheater as well. This is, could be an older person, older than you. I don't know. <laughs> you could. This could be you. Okay, anyway, I'm going to go ahead and jump up out of here. Um, like I said, I'm not doing any other clarifications and stuff like that. So, take it or leave it. It's up to you. But I'm going to go ahead and get out. Later, boo-boo.